Now, dogs love nothing more than going for a good walk. But for Bear, the six-year-old Rottweiler, it's swimming that gets his tail wagging the most, and for a very good reason. Last year, he was left virtually paralysed after falling. Vets even told his heartbroken owners that would have to put him down. But thanks to a second opinion and months of exercising in water, he is back on four paws, and Simon's been to meet him. Catherine and her dog Bear both struggle to walk, but the Rottweiler can count himself lucky that he can take these shaky steps at all. A year ago he tripped and fell while out in the garden, and Catherine soon found he was almost completely paralysed. I took him to the vet, uh, who said that basically he had hip dysplasia, that both his hips had, had worn away and he needed to be put down. I was just horrified. I refused, basically, and said that I wanted a second opinion and took him to another vet. Bear was in fact suffering from a spinal condition causing his muscles to waste away. So Catherine brought him for swimming sessions at this doggy hydrotherapy centre. Good boy. Round here. Come on, Bear. And after many months of synchronised splashing, his strength gradually increased. When I first started swimming with Bear, I had to physically move his legs for him because he had no movement there whatsoever. Over time, he's actually managed to be able to move his legs himself. So with every movement, he's helping his muscles build up, and that's what we're aiming at. Bear certainly gets a good workout, and Catherine has seen a huge change since he started the exercise. Oh, it's amazing. It's almost 100%. I mean, when we first brought him here, we thought there was no hope, to be honest with you. Um, all four legs had gone. But since he's come here, he's, he's every week we've seen an improvement, really, to the point where he's, he's up and walking now. And after all that hard work comes the reward. A long soapy soaking is followed by a good rub down, and something tells me he secretly enjoys it. Simon Pusey, 5 News. Looks like he's loving that.